Hi, John. I'm sick. But, I've made a commitment to this video blog, and gosh darn it, I'm here to blow into tissues and kick some ass and I'm all out of tissues. Thank you for not mentioning that my last video was like half bloopers. I'm not proud of it. This week has been extremely boring for me. I mean, what with my best friend and your girlfriend deciding to go on a two-month trip to New Zealand together. Dude, I was in This was brought by Esther, oh so I said... Everybody wave! Oh, hi! I'm sure you and I have been having about the same week. You guys are best friends. Now, Mr. Frodo, I love it. You shouldn't make fun. I was being oh. serious. I'll not go near him, and neither should you. <laughs> Look at how much longer it is than the last time I saw you. Look at how much worse it is than the last time I saw you. Also, I've been sick for what feels like a year. Of course, I could just be really bored. Now, you had some questions for me last week, and I wanted to make sure that I spent the proper amount of time thinking about my answers. As you can tell, I'm very worried about getting them right. Okay, now for the questions. Is this gonna be, like, a spy thing? No. Where are you guys looking to move? Well, what I think we have here is a failure to communicate, because I'm pretty sure you know the answer to this question. But, in short, California, but more specifically, Orange County. What kind of stuff do you want to know about? The answer to the ultimate question of the life, the universe, and everything? Too broad. How about your hobbies, your passions, your weird fetishes? If there's one person to watch on YouTube, who is it? Well, with my long and varied experience with YouTube, I'm sure you can guess that I am an expert. I know we're both already aware of the Vlogbrothers, because they did help inspire this project, so I won't mention them. I could say the Shaytards are a Torotrejo for vlogging, or I could say the Fine Bros are Rhett and Link for laughs, but I think I'll go with somebody that's a little bit newer. Her name is Carrie Hope Fletcher, and you can find her at It's Way Past My Bedtime. Now, I think you will particularly like her because she's huge into books, she loves tea, and she's currently playing Eponine in Les Mis on stage in London. What are you reading? As you already know, I've been on a bit of a YA kick recently, and I just finished The Maze Runner and Divergent. So next on my list is The Fifth Wave, and I actually had not heard of this until about uh, four days ago. I was just in Barnes & Noble, and I happened upon... Um, this book and its sequel. Um, they had tons of copies of the sequel and they had very few copies of this book left, so I figured that's probably a good sign and I grabbed it. It's pretty good so far. Um, also, I'm about halfway through Outlander and this very poor beat up copy actually belongs to Alicia. I have no idea how I'm gonna get it back to her because I'm moving before they get back from New Zealand, but I'll figure it out. Um, but yeah, I uh, loved the TV show. In fact, I started knitting because of it and I'm hoping that this will kind of help tide me over till the show comes back in April. Oh man, this is getting a little long. I should probably wrap it up. But first, I have a couple of questions for you. I feel like we should better introduce ourselves, just in case the people that are watching this video don't know us as well as we know each other. So, John, tell me about your life. I'll do mine next week. What is your favorite quote from any movie? I want to read a fantasy series that I've never read before, so should I start with Song of Ice and Fire or the Mistborn trilogy? All right, I guess that's it. Here's looking at you, kid. See you on Monday. Oh, and one more. How many movie references did I make in this video?